you don't have the dogs, yeah, haven't fallen off, yeah. Come with a classic, they come around years later and say it's a sleeper. The ears are rare, the petty is rare. Watch on my ex for a feature. Deposit the money to Brenda Leticia, Belinda Felicia. She gave me twice, I didn't even know for her once. You know I'm a pleaser. Hey you guys, welcome back to another video. Um, it's another reaction video. This is gonna be uh, Pop the Balloon or Find Love episode 15. Um, but this is gonna be like part two because it's like the second guy that came up. So yeah, let's get started. Go ahead and bring out our next single guy. Hello, welcome in, I'll have you hold that. What's your name? My name's Josh, I'm 37. Okay, and Josh, what do you do? I invest in stocks and uh, I'm getting into content creation. Okay. So yeah, so. these guys, oh, him for sure, uh, was in the lineup before the previous episode. Uh, poker, I've seen it. You know, things like that. That's, okay. that's mainly what I do nice. most of the time. Yeah. <laughs> and now what are some things you look for in a woman? Uh... I don't, I don't too much care for some people that smoke, like okay. especially cigarettes and things like that. So somebody that likes to be in the gym, mm -hmm. you know, like an active woman, because I'm active myself. Um, somebody that's loyal, mm -hmm. humble. Okay. Like those are the main things. Got it. Now, what are yeah. some of your deal breakers? Uh, well, the smoking for sure. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, that's the biggest thing. Um, Put them cancer sticks down, liar, ladies and gents. I don't care for a liar, but... Those are the main two. All right, got it. Mm. All right, so Josh, we don't have any pop balloons, so you're doing pretty well. He's and cute. so what that means is I'm Seems actually like going to go ahead and switch it on over to you. So there are quite a few ladies here. So for the first he round, you could have put on something different says, to come on this show, though. You know what I mean? Yeah, I'm going to have you pop <laughs> three balloons, kind of just based off of what you're seeing, who doesn't really fall into your type, whatever it may be. So let me hand you this. And go ahead and pop those three, and then I'll go ahead um, and ask you why we ended up popping them after. Okay. Okay, I think he's going to pop the black dress. The purple dress. And I don't know, the pink dress, dress next there. Just, just taking a guess. Three. Yes, sir. Three balloons. Let's see. I don't even know y'all. Okay, two more. And one more. Okay. All right, start. I got two so out of three. Did it pop in? Two out of three. <laughs> <laughs> All right, if we can start with your name and age. Hi, my name is Shay, and I'm 37. And Shay, uh, you did have your balloon unpopped for Josh. Why so? Because when he came out. I just I thought he was attractive, and I just wanted to hear more about him. Okay, all right. Feel his energy out. <laughs> and Josh, why'd you end up popping Shay's balloon? Uh, just not my type. Uh, it's that simple. Okay, and what makes her not really your type? Mm, just not normally the type I go for. Uh, maybe the dress. The dress. Not really. I was gonna say that. Thing, but okay. like she's she's a beautiful woman. Just not not my type. All right, let's go on to our next lady over here. If we can start with your name and age. Davinia, I'm 41. Okay. And Davinia, why did you have your balloon unpopped for Josh? Um, I think Josh is handsome, and I think he was well-spoken, so I just wanted to see if the vibe was there, chemistry, and obviously it wasn't, so. <laughs> We're good. <laughs> and Josh, why did you end up popping your balloon? I mean, popping uh, her balloon, yeah. Um, just, uh, I don't like a lot of makeup. You know, um, I just, that's all, that's all it is. Okay. That's, all, that's all I have to go off of, you know. Got it. All yeah. right. Thank you. And over here, we can start with your name and age. My name is Chanel Coco Stiletto. I'm 42. Okay. And Chanel, you had your balloon on pop for Josh. Why? Well, he came out very handsome, well-spoken. However, he did say his deal breaker was smoking. I am not a smoker when it comes to cigarette, but I am a medicinal, so I'm pretty sure that's, I was going to pop my balloon, but I figured you can do it for yourself. So, that's what it was. Okay. All right. And Josh, why did you end up popping her balloon? I actually don't mind weed. Like, oh. that's cool. It's just the cigarettes. Like, yeah. that, that's what it is. But just, like, the makeup and, you know what I mean? Like, just I like too much. Yeah. Look, so, that's okay. pretty much mm -hmm. it. Cool. Thank you, ladies. Mm -hmm. Okay. Call, so, we like do still said, have quite a few three, balloons left unpopped. Go ahead and ask these ladies a question to help you narrow it down. Let's see. Okay. Um... Do any of y'all have kids? 
<laughs> Everyone. <laughs> they all got yeah, you. Sure. Okay. Um, I guess I'll just ask a different question. Yep. <laughs> I got kids too, so we good. How many kids do you have? I have two kids. Two kids, okay. How many kids y'all got? Okay. Let's oh, oh hold on y'all. I'm gonna come to y'all. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's start here. Okay. If we can have your name and age and how many kids do you have? Hi, I'm Mrs. Parker, but I go by Mrs. I'm 39 and I have two kids. Um a girl, 20, and my son is 15. Okay. Yeah. A little bit older, that's okay. cool. Okay. Name and age and how many kids you have. Hi, I'm Tracy. I'm 37 and I have one child. I have a daughter who's nine. Okay. And down over here, <laughs> your name and age and how many kids you have. Shay, I'm 37. I have one son who will be 14 on the 8th of this month. Okay. Name and age and how many kids you have. Hey, Josh. I'm Janae. I have three kids. Okay. Yeah. Uh, what ages? 17, 12, and 7. Okay. Name and age and how many kids you have? Venusian, 39. I have a son, he's 20, and a daughter that's 7. Okay. Okay. All right. Let's back it on up. (laughs) I don't think we got the age of your kids. I know you said you have two. Yeah, I have a 13 year old and an 8 year old. Okay, 13 and 8. Okay. Any other questions for these ladies? Kind of help you narrow it down. I don't know. I, I, don't, I guess the kids aren't a deal breaker, obviously, for you. No, I mean, okay. <laughs> actually, I prefer kids because at least you know what it is. But, Got it. Okay. Yeah. Um, what is your toxic trait? Mm, okay. What is your toxic mm-hmm. trait? I think I can read energy, and sometimes I might overthink things a little too much. Like, I might read into the energy a little too much, which can create just create, like, overthinking. Mm-hmm. So, so you jump to conclusions. I wouldn't necessarily say I jump to conclusions, but like I just probably think sometimes a little too much. Mm-hmm. Potentially jump to conclusions, but mm-hmm. not quite. Okay. No, <laughs> when you overthink things, know. like we're all human, you know. So like, mm-hmm. it's like a we all overthink sometimes. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay. Hey, so yeah. are you gonna be able to reassure her <laughs> your or drink? not? I believe my toxic trait is seeing red flags and still trying to work through the potential of a person. So mm-hmm. I think that hasn't worked well for me. Um, always trying to see the good um, instead of just letting certain situations go. Okay. okay. Let's go down here. All right. What's your toxic trait? I'm always trying to help people and I tend to hinder people sometimes. Like it's kind of unhealthy sometimes because I'm always like, Trying to, I help overly help. Okay. Okay. <laughs> What's your toxic trait? Um, if I'm not being heard, I get a little frustrated. Can probably get loud. So that's my toxic trait. Do you get violent? No, okay. but I am. <laughs> I'm just <laughs> aggressive a little bit. Okay. Yeah, by nature, okay. but Ver- not on verbally. purpose. <laughs> verbally, okay. <laughs> that's the same thing. <laughs> Yeah, I get a little loud when I'm frustrated and not being hurt. Okay. Mm. Yeah. So are you a good listener, my man? Uh, Detaching. Completely withdrawing. Yeah. Like, all the time or just something? No, just like if we are having a disagreement and, again, like I'm not being hurt, I withdraw. So I'll need some time. Mm. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Okay, Josh. I am going to have you pop two balloons based off of, you know, the things you've heard, what you've seen, all that good stuff. Two balloons. Ooh. Um, uh, Two balloons. So I think he's going to, I don't know. I think the lady in the pink dress, maybe just because I want him to pop her balloon. Not because nothing's wrong with her, but I don't know over helping and then i feel like she's looking at the camera versus like him maybe a little bit too much but whatever anyway so her and then um maybe the withdrawing one but i don't know why in my head i'm thinking orange dress but let's see um i'm gonna go right here okay and then one more Okay, so why did we end up popping her balloon? Cause she she too nice, like a people pleaser. I don't, cause I've I've dealt with that before, and you know what I mean. Like I can't, like a people pleaser, I can't do it. Mm-hmm. I wouldn't necessarily call it a people pleaser, but 
if you knew my background, I, like I do a lot of um, giving back and things of that nature. So I have a heart. So I'm not going to say a people pleaser because I do have a flip side of me, okay. like to a certain extent, but no respect. Okay. So, but you put people before yourself. No, 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 no. To, to a default, right? No, no, I don't put people before myself. I extend a lot of help. Like I'm always there to try to help someone. And sometimes that can be unhealthy. Like let them figure it out. Stop trying to help them. Mm -hmm. Now I'm not going to put anybody before myself because I'm a mother. So I have to have my sanity and things of that nature to be a parent. But Mm -hmm. yeah, I just, everybody knows I'm always helping. So (laughs) see, but the thing about that is you're going to stress yourself out. And then you don't come home and I got to deal with that <laughs> because you're trying to do too much for everybody else. You know what mm-hmm. I'm saying? I, I don't bring so, promise home, but that's okay. still respect. Okay. Okay. Still respect. Respect. Still respect. 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 Okay. Yeah, I'm not okay. bringing it home. We, we leaving it at the front door. Okay. <laughs> respect. Right, let's go over here. Why do you end up popping this balloon? Because she loud. <laughs> I just, I don't like that. <laughs> I'm, I'm very chill. So if you're too loud, like, nah, I'm good on that. Oh, okay. me. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> Another loud one, Pop. Who was that? We did get a pop. Where was the pop? Back here, back here, back here. Oh, okay. Miss Parker. Popping our balloon. I pop because I could get loud sometimes. Like I'm chill, but I like to be loud sometimes. So I don't want somebody like, oh, you're too loud. You can be loud with me. But are you disrespectful? No. I don't care if you loud like because you having fun. But I mean, like when you disrespectful. Oh, okay. that's what I'm talking about. Well, thank you for clarifying. Like, yeah. Mm-hmm. So do you, after you clarify that, do you want the balloon back or is it? I'm gonna leave it pop. Oh. You're very handsome though. Thank you. Okay. You're, You're very pretty. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So we do have two balloons left unpopped. Ladies, any questions for Josh? You wanna start down there? Okay. Let's let's go down there. She has a question. <laughs> All right. What's your question? How do you um, resolve conflict? What's your conflict resolution style? Um, I think communication is very important. So I think it's important to like take a step back and see where you're wrong and just kind of see how you can find some middle ground and talk, talk through things. Cause 99% of the time it's just misunderstanding. You know, if you talk, get through it. Mm-hmm. So that's, and do you know your love languages? Um, I like Kisses on the neck and compliments. Physical touch. Physical touch is worthy of affirmation. Right. Well, fit, like, fit, I'm not going to say physical touch because, like, I like my space, right? Mm. So I don't like to be crowded or, you know what I mean? Like, even, like, in bed and stuff like that. Mm-hmm. Like, you got your side, I got my side. Like, don't come near me. Oh. Right? <laughs> not, and it's, it's not like, <laughs> I know how that sounds, but I just like my space. I just put it that way. Okay. So, mm. kiss me on my neck all you want. You know, um, <laughs> yeah, and just compliment me and we good. Okay. Right. And what's your sun sign? My what? Your sun sign. My sun, I don't know. Like my, like, uh. Your zodiac. Okay, zodiac. I'm a Capricorn. Okay. Those are all my questions. Okay. Mm-hmm. All right, let's head on sun back sign this way. way. Keep it simple, okay? You got any questions for Josh? Um, so, I have a few, actually. Um. So who currently is delusional about you? <laughs> so are you single? Do you believe you're single? Or is there anyone out there that believes they're in a relationship with you? I'm, um, I'm single. I am single. Uh, I, I do have a rotation, but... It's... <laughs> I mean, what? <laughs> Thank you. But Thank you for I your honesty. I just gotta be honest because it's gonna come out eventually. So you know what I mean. Like, I appreciate it. <laughs> oh, he was doing That's so good, good, my gosh. I talked to several females. You know. That's a pH just, balance issue. No, sir. I'm not doing nothing with it with everybody. If, if that's what you're trying to get at, but I'm we talk weak, the y'all. <laughs> I need my man to be my man, my man, my man. Okay. You're crazy about me and only me. So when you talk to me, you drop everybody else. Mm-hmm. So so make me crazy about you. Maybe I'll drop the rotation. There's probably some sweet girl out there that's crazy about you that's already in rotation. Uh, yeah. <laughs> she probably love you. No. Nah. <laughs> we, 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 I won't let it get to that point unless like it's how can you control a, a woman's emotions nah. uh, <laughs> no, no. she popped down here too after you said something about you got rotation 
All right. Y'all got rotation. This is hilarious. So it was the rotation. It was that and the makeup comments. Like I like a nice clean beat. I I live for it. So I'm not gonna stop wearing makeup because you don't like it. I didn't say it was a deal breaker. I just said I don't like too much makeup. But... Wow, well, I like makeup. Okay, <laughs> what you got on is cool. Like. I ain't worried about it. I appreciate it. that. But you said you don't like it, and I wear it, like, <laughs> a lot. You're, you're overthinking that one, but all right. Okay. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, Josh, I thought we had somebody for you. <laughs> what happened? Okay, okay well, yeah, that comment took you out, spots. my guy. Go ahead and give it up for him, ladies. Thank you for coming out, Josh. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> That was hilarious. I mean, I thought he was going to find somebody, too. I can't lie to y'all. Um, but, yeah, just that last comment about that rotation. Like, mm, not saying you should have lied or whatever, but you shouldn't have let that out on this show. Like, you know what I mean? Like, mm -mm. like I get you might be, like, talking to or entertaining people. But, like, if you was going to take this seriously, then I don't know, man then you would, in your head, give them a fair chance. And if they do, you know what I'm saying? If you rocking with them, then the other ones will, like, fade away. But you just kind of ruined it before it even got started. But anyways, what do you guys think? <laughs> what y'all think about that episode? Um, the last two. If he didn't make that comment, which one do y'all think he would have picked? I think it would have been orange dress, honestly. I think it would have been orange dress. But yeah, guess that doesn't matter now. But anyways, yeah, um, thank y'all for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you guys will know when I upload again. And until next time, bye. Yeah, you are that